I had been on staff at my church for a couple of years and uh, I was um, I was wearing myself out and I I finally it, it dawned on me that I had been serving my ministry in my strength instead of serving God in his strength which is such a fine line such a fine line and uh and I I felt like God kind of reminded me of the story of Martha and Mary and I was reading through that and I you know I remember in Sunday school I always felt like poor Martha got such a bad rap you know because she's like (laughs) I remember my Sunday school teacher being like you know don't be like Martha because she was bad and she didn't want to spend time with Jesus (laughs) and And that is not at all what happened. This is what happened. I'm going to retell poor Martha's story. She's like, you know, she knows her friend Jesus is coming and she's getting her house already. She's like vacuuming. She probably wasn't vacuuming. Sweeping and (laughs) she's like baking a quiche or something like we have this morning. And she's getting everything ready for Jesus who's coming and she's so excited. and, And so Jesus gets there and she's still, you know, hurrying around and and trying to get everything ready and and she looks over in the corner and there's her whiny wimpy sister mary sitting over there just hanging out with jesus which is what martha wanted to do the whole time she wanted to spend time with them and she looks over there and if i had been martha i would be super irritated (laughs) i would have been like for real seriously you couldn't sweep a little bit more like so but the thing i love about that story is that jesus knew Martha's heart and he he comes over to her and he says Martha you are anxious and troubled about many things and I feel like <laughs> Jesus says that to me all the time Lindsay you are anxious and troubled about many things just come spend time with me come sit with me and let me pour into you and um it's the, this is the same Jesus who said come to me all you who labor and are heavy laden and I will give you rest take my yoke upon you and learn of me for I am meek and lowly in heart and you shall find rest for your souls, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. And uh, what a promise that we have, just an invitation to come sit at Jesus' feet and, and soak up time with him.